What's up, Tom Keepers? Me, Tom Gamer here, bringing you new Amnesia the Collection. So, if ready, I'm ready, Tom, to roll the intro. Alright guys, so today I'm going to be bringing you Amnesia Collection, specifically The Dark Descent. This is the first game of the series of Amnesia. If you didn't know about it, this is like one of the, one of the, not the one, one of the first popular games. It's one like, uh, one that just exploded very much because of its YouTube success and tw I, I don't know on Twitch if it was any special or anything like that, but that doesn't matter. So I wanted to try it out. I don't know if I'm going to be making a series, a playthrough series out of it. Uh, apparently the first one is not long, but it's more puzzle base and the second the, a machine for pig is more of a horror uh, first person horror type game uh, and Justine I couldn't find any like I, I didn't actually look for it because I I know that the dark descent and the machine for pigs are the most popular ones between the three here I'm playing the ps4 version. This is a ps4 uh, PlayStation plus free game for the month of October just in time for Halloween uh, hopefully this month I'll have time to play more horror games. I still have Until Dawn to finish and stuff like that. So those are games you might see during the month of October. Or uh, of course you'll see more Cuphead. Uh, maybe Shadow of War. We'll see if I'm able to get my hands on it. Budget's a bit strict so we'll have to see. Uh, but yeah, so without further ado... That, that's my phone. <laughs> so without further ado, let's just jump right to uh, The Dark Descent and try it out. Don't forget. London, at, at, uh, okay, I can move now. Okay. What have I done? This is crazy. Don't forget. Don't forget. I must stop him. Focus. My name is. Is. I am Daniel. Okay. Alrighty. That's blood or a flower. Get up, you lazy bum. Alright, where are we? A memento has been added to your journal. Make sure to check these whenever you're stuck. Okay, okay. I'm over here. Okay. Okay. And when you're holding an object, press on the throw. Hadouken! Oh, shit. Ah, oh, damn it. It's a weird effect you got there. Got no timber. And I can walk slightly faster. Okay. Another dark room. Okay, I don't see much. Guess I gotta follow this pink stuff, whatever it is. What's going on? What the fuck is going on? Any? Never seen a door do that before. I guess we're going to keep going. I guess that's not the right thing. Uh, hold down R2 and move right stick to open the door. Oh, shit. Okay. This is, uh... Ooh, uh... What is this? Ten tender box. Can I hide in here like this? Am I hiding? Oh, 
Okay. The blurry effect's a bit annoying. I know that's like part of the game, but a bit annoying though. Fire! Can I grab something from the fire now? Can I throw this in the fire and make it bigger? Oh. More timber. Guess I gotta light shit up. I used to light candle and other light sources in the current number of shows in your inventory. Guess we're gonna keep going then. Okay, we're not going that way. I have to keep going that way. Got a lot of candle lights that weren't open. Uh, oh. Must use all of them in case. That makes sense. I tried pulling, but I didn't try pushing. Nice move. What the fuck do I hear running? I'm not a fan of this. going on here okay hopefully that doesn't happen at random interval thought there was a door why do doors have to keep opening can I just open the door myself Bye. I don't need that. I'm gonna peek. I'm gonna keep my uh, Tinder box. Just gotta be a hole somewhere. Old archives. I guess that's where we're going now. Okay. There's so many random noise that don't make sense. Witnessing unsettling event will reduce your sanity. It can increase uh, completing puzzle and make progress. Oh, great. Beware, when standing in darkness, your sanity will slowly drain. Turn on light. They were about using the third box to search other sources. Well, you could have told me that at the fucking beginning here, boss. Ew. I need to get out of this room, I guess. Alrighty. Does not get any simple. Uh, if you have pick up the when filled with oil, it can be turned on by pressing. Oh lordy! Thank God! Thank God for that! Alrighty. The pull door.
Not super creepy. What am I kidding? This is fucking annoying. A furnace. That's unsettling. Hmm. It has a good it has good atmospheric uh, music for sure where I need it to go I guess do 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 what the fuck is picked up oil okay uh, okay of August 1839 I wish I could ask how much you remember I don't know if there'll be anything left after I consume this drink don't be afraid, Daniel. I can't tell you why, but know this. I choose to forget. Try to find comfort and strength in that fact. There is a purpose. You are my final effort to put things right. God willing, the name Alexander of Brandenburg still invokes bitter anger in you. If not, this will sound horrible. Go to the inner sanctum, find Alexander, and kill him. His body is old and weak, and yours, young and strong. He will be no match for you. One last You say thing. that. A shadow is following you. It's a living nightmare, breaking down reality. I have tried everything, and there is no way to fight back. You need to escape it as long as you can. Redeem us both, Daniel. Descend into the darkness where Alexander waits and murder him. Your former self, Daniel. That's not creepy at all. There's a there's a leaf. Entrance hall. Guess that's where we're going. What? Why are you telling me to run? Telling someone to run in a game is never good. Please don't do that. Alexander, is it inside the castle? In a manner of speaking. Come, bring the lamp. You've been to the refinery, have you not? I don't believe I have. Is it connected to the... What did you call it? The inner sanctum. My most precious chamber, Daniel. And it lies well beyond the refinery. In fact, it lies beneath the very stone of Brennenberg. You're okay? Ew, take that. Squish, squish. All right, I'm going in the lower sanctuary. Let's go see if there's just something. Why, why?
wine cellar. Laboratory. It's tough and pliant. It can't be torn by hands or tool. Fantastic. Oh, there's a dog. Aww. Ah, sure. Let's go with the laboratory. It's always good. Alright. Gotta rest out again. Right. That's a weird looking lab. Anybody else see that? Chemistry pot. Let me see, let me see. And one part aqua force. God damn it. I've done fucked up this time. Bye-bye. Alright, I think I'm... I think my mom's calling me. I think I gotta go. May 1839. The unflinching African sun has continued to plague our expedition, making it impossible to dig until dusk. How Professor Herbert managed to find the location in these vast plains of nothingness remains a mystery to me. Hmm. When I asked him about the tomb again, he told me about the legend of Tin Hanan, the mother of us all. An interesting story in its own right, but I can't help feeling there's more. Later that evening, we uncovered a passage beneath the dunes leading to a sand-covered stone structure. The professor was confident it was the tomb we sought and ordered the others to clear the way late into the dark, cold night. Tomorrow, I shall lead the men into the ancient structure, hoping to reach the burial chamber. No matter what the professor is keeping from me, the dig should yield something interesting to take back to London and the British Museum. Alright.
that god awful noise. Studium. The load. Seventeenth of May, eighteen thirty-nine. My hands tremble as I write. I feel a need to document my tribulation, for I fear that my memory will fail me if I linger. Today, I took some men and ventured into the dark, ancient passage we uncovered. Our torches burned faintly in the murky air as we slowly made our way underground. The men were superstitious and fearful. They argued loudly, and I felt their strange language getting to me. I mustered my strength and yelled at them to continue down the slopes and broken steps. The crudely carved passage confused me. It looked much older than the 4th century structure we had expected. I was trapped. Fucking book you. Hello?
Uh, the fuck's going on now? Am I dead? 17th of May, 1839. After pounding the unforgiving stone wall for what seemed like an eternity, I realized it was hopeless. I was trapped. I fell to the ground, gasping for air, trying to focus. That's when I saw a faint blue shimmer. My weakened body was heavy to carry, but I managed to push myself toward the enchanting light. Okay, am I sure I want to do that? It was waiting for me. Enclosed in dark nothingness, I felt myself drawn to the mystic light. Yeah, of course. No. I reached out, closing it in my hands. The faint glow escaped my fingers and began to spark brightly and spirit me away, unlocking alien memories of spiraling towers, endless deserts, and impossible geometry. Okay. The next thing I can remember is the grating sound of stone being lifted. The voices of the Arabs pulling me to safety. Grasped firmly in my hands was the broken pieces of a most peculiar relic. Oh, kiddo. Reinforce weak structures. The ground will tremble, and there's a risk everything will cave in on us, especially downstairs. Here, here, and there. Let's get the servants working on it. Okay, we found a new way. You have to be swift when you activate the first one. You hear that? If it stops, you'll have to start over. Isn't all this a bit excessive? You can never be too careful, Daniel. Anyway, I'll leave this right here. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Uh, not much going on. I know there's uh, some monsters in the game and all that. I've seen some gameplay later in the game. Not, not no. I don't know what I need to do exactly, but I know I'm just trying to progress the story. But sorry about that. I got the burps all of a sudden. Anyway, it's a it's a fun little game. If I had more time, I would keep playing it. Uh, it does have a good, uh, interesting, scary vibe to it. The music, the scary sounds surrounding you, and all that. I know this game is a bit older. Uh, so it's, uh, the graphically it's not very, might not be always appealing, but it still has that little, uh, that not grungy, but like scary aspect to it. I understand, like, it's more, uh, it's very puzzle focused. Like I was saying in the beginning, I do notice that, uh, I might later on try a, a machine for pig. I know the stories are not 
are someone they hint to each other but are not necessarily related to one each other one another so we'll have to see from there so hopefully you guys enjoyed if you enjoyed of course hit that like button and subscribe to the channel of course you can follow me everywhere me time gamer twitter twitch facebook instagram and right here youtube.com forward slash me time gamer where i post a new video every day of the week monday to friday 3 p.m eastern time of course leave, leave a comment below uh if you know what to do next from from this room the room i just finished at uh of course um what else i can say here uh, any hints or tips if you want to see more of uh me playing amnesia the dark descent i'll keep uh, i'll give it another shot uh i don't know if i'll i'll go back it's it's good but it's not i'm not interesting enough to keep playing it uh i got other games i want to play and this is unfortunately it's sort of a uh it, it's good but it could be a bit better in my opinion but it's still i still see the appeal in the game anyway Thank you so much guys for watching, of course, and I will see you in the next video. Keep on keeping on.